plan. My game plan the whole week was to lay up on 17 and, and obviously I was one understanding on the tee so I knew I needed two birdies for my target. So I actually pulled drive and I hit drive, I hit it about 15 short of the green, chipped it up to about two and a half foot and hold the putt, you know. So that was not according to game plan but nonetheless it was, it, it worked out in the end. I set myself a personal target in my mind, so my, my target was to get to three under. I thought if I could get to three under, it would be a competitive target with the guys coming in. And obviously we've got the live scoring and we're watching that while we're playing. And, and coming down the back nine, I was, I was at one under and I saw the guys were at three under. And I thought, you know what, just get to three. Three is a good target. And finished off at two and when I walked off, I, I honestly thought it was one shy. But fortunately, obviously, a bit of help from the wind and the rest of the field and I, I managed to get it by one. Yeah, look, it, it, it's, a, it's a huge honour, you know, it's, it's, it's one, I've always wanted an SA title behind my name and um, I've waited a long time and I'm very happy to get it done and I was actually, when you mentioned DP World Tour and I was talking to Jaden Shaper over the last two days or so and I was saying to him, he, he won at the Zalza a couple of years ago and we were from the same club and I said to him, I just want to do what he did a few years ago, so, so to get the win and uh, to have the SA, an SA title behind my name means a lot to me, it really, really does.